Former DA leader Tony Leon believes South Africans are relieved that former president Jacob Zuma is no longer the president of the country. He was speaking during an interview with ENCS Vuyom Voko. But Leon is worried about corruption and whether President Cyril Ramaphosa will deliver on his promises to voters. Such enormous relief across the board, across all races, classes, parties, that Cyril Ramaphosa is the president and not Jacob Zuma or Dr in Kusasana, Lamini Zuma, that Cyril gets a, a, a big advantage from that, and I fully share that sentiment, let me say. But you've also got to say, well, yeah, it's CR, he leads the party, but he probably only leads about 50% of it. The other 50% you don't even want to look at. Because no, but there's a reality there that, uh, I mean, everyone in the ANC would or should understand, and it is that <laughs> uh, you have to support the president in order to get the ANC elected. So those numbers we saw at Nazareth probably don't matter at all um, right now. Well, if that is was a win for, or a vote for Ramaphosa means a vote for the ANC. And that's probably all that matters at this stage. Well, I'm sure it matters on the 8th of May. What is going to count for on the 10th or the 20th of May is another matter within the ANC because people draw different interpretations from the election results and that applies across the board. So I think that, you know, going back to the party that I was uh, the leader of for many years, the DA, I think it's, you know, it's, it's got a task that is, that is a challenge to try and keep different communities together under one banner and to advance a program that uh, at the moment is kind of quite tough medicine but which will lead to the long-term health of this country. And it's not just going out handing out a lollipop to everyone. I mean, you know, Cyril went to uh, Alexandra last week and said, we're going to build a million houses in five years. Well, that means we should put, someone said 575 need to be built every day. Well, mm. I guarantee you not one has been put up since he left there. So you can go around with a confetti path full of promises and slogans. The question is, have you got the courage to deliver? And on the scorecard, and admittedly only in a province and in some municipalities, there is less corruption, there's better governance, there's more pro-poor delivery in the areas that the DA's had an opportunity to deliver at at those levels. And I think that is something worth trying to build on.